Blake didn't know that your forte was voiceover when she asked you to do this? She did not. She saw, she had seen me in the Coen Brothers film, A Serious Man, and I told her, you know, I spent many years uh, tilling th those fields, but she did not know that. <laughs> um, she just thought it was uh, plausible that I could, you know, I had the right kind of sound and kind of looked, <laughs> kind of looked like a voiceover guy. <laughs> Um, another thing about Lake that uh, Lake was this was her first feature that she ever directed. She directed a short before this, and she her poise and her ability to direct was just uh, remarkable to me. Because let's face it, the industry does not crave a female yeah, sound. Yeah, Dad, you made me painfully aware of that my whole well, life. Not being sexist, like... that's just the truth. You should stick with the accents. I mean, that's your thing. That's what you're good at. What was that great, that Russian Star Wars thing you used to do as a yeah, kid? Yeah, I know the one you're talking about. Let me hear it. <laughs> These are not the droids you're looking for. <laughs> I just love that. It's so random. You know, really good directors don't say too much, but they have the capacity to know a certain thing to say that then somehow opens up the floodgates and you really get something from it. Um, Blake, with her very limited experience, somehow just had this kind of native ability. And I was amazed at her poise and her ability to, to you know, have confidence in her actors and, and not freak out. And, you know, it's, directing is hard. You got 9,000 things all at once you have to deal with. And it's, you know, actors in a sense have it easy because you have really only one thing to concentrate on. Uh, and when you, it's done, you go home and that's that. You don't have to worry about what's happening next week and next month and you know if, and you know if, it, if you're a director particularly a writer director like Lake is and like the Coen brothers <laughs> are, you're talking about a minimum of three years on each project and Lake was acting in it with you wasn't she she was acting it and what she did was she had a friend of hers a woman called Janixa Bravo who has gone on to become quite a notable director but she had a friend and she said in the scenes that I'm in, that I'm acting in, do you mind just kind of keeping an eye on things to make sure that, you know, directorially things look okay? Mm -hmm. And her friend agreed to do that. Uh, and, 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 you know, it worked out very well. Um, that, and I, I enjoyed that part particularly because as an actor, you're always looking for the contradictions in characters. Um, you know, here's a guy who's obviously extremely selfish, uh, narcissistic, and also very threatened. I mean, he's threatened by his own daughter's success. And yet, in his own screwy way, he does love his daughter. So that, you, you, as an actor, I'm always looking for what is heroic in people that are, that are not admirable, and what the flaws are in the characters that are heroic. The, the kind of um, things that aren't consistent. That's what makes the new and interesting.